All right, so. Hello, the internet. Hello, everybody. My 10-year-old is here to help me today. Hello. And I found, I wish so badly I would have taken a before picture, but I have a clock that I found at Goodwill. It was $2. And I took it apart and took the numbers off and took the mechanism off. So this is kind of an experiment because I hope I can put it back together. Um, I mixed all these colors. This is uh, Anita's Metallic Deep Purple. This is oh, Apple here. Barrel King's Gold. This is Apple Barrel Tuscan Teal. That's a good one. <laughs> this is Dark Blue Craft Smart and Multi-Surface Folk Art Dark Brown. And then I'm making up with, uh, decided not to hold a grudge, I'm going to make up with this silver uh, Ooh, Artist, gray, loft, my favorite color. Artist Loft Silver Metallic. So I'm not going to put very much in there. I was kind of cranky at it for my last failed pours, but it, we're going to move on. So I already mixed um, all of these paints about 50-50 with this Flood Floetrol. Floetrol. <laughs> and um, I have not put any silicone in, and I also added water. So they're kind of that perfect uh, consistency. Grippy. They're drippy. Thanks. They're, I have my sidekick today. So I have my... Yeah. Um, so they're the perfect... So I added water and Floetrol to those. Now I'm going to add some silicone. I use this CRC silicone found at Walmart or wherever. Last time I did my... And I'm going to put it on the spin just to get that spread out. Um, I think I'm going to put a little bit of silicone in the purple metallic. Easy with that the maybe, silicone. Maybe a lot. <laughs> and I'm just going to stir a little bit, and then I'll probably just put it in another, I'll put it uh, in my purple. Uh, I'm not going to, actually, that's all I'm going to stir it. Oh. Mm. Just to do a little bit to see if I stir it less, if that will give me bigger cells. So we'll see. Man, I don't want to stir it. Yeah. That makes me sad. Sorry, Charlie. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead Oh, uh, maybe I'll put silicone in one more. Maybe I'll put a little bit in the blue. Just for kicks. Okay, thanks. Thanks. So, he's going to be my... It's kind of a lot of paint, so I don't know that I'll use all of this, and maybe I'll just make more videos. So, here's this. Here's my pour cup. I'm going to have um, my metallic be a face. The birds are noisy today. Here's my yellow and my gold. It's kind of a random selection of colors. I always like to pick some warm and some cool just to see how it goes. I really like that teal color. We'll see see if I can do this without because purple and yellow are totally gonna get muddy, especially with this brown. So I don't know if I'm gonna like how this turns out, but we'll see. And then a little bit of silver. I know this is totally the combination for perfect mud. So I'm gonna not do very much uh, tilting, and we'll see how it goes. All right. So, so um, spin master, like a DJ. Yeah. Perfect consistency of mud too. see how that goes now torch it, torch it. I uh, put some tape over the, those uh, letters I should have said before I did all that the letters or the numbers are just little silver snap-on things so I snapped those all the way off three of them broke but we'll see how it turns out and then I prepped the outside with and then I also put uh, painters tape over those probably should have said that before that's okay and then so it's a it's got a little bit of hmm, well it's got the brown in it so it's hard to tell what's muddy and what's not so I'm just gonna give a little bit of a torch to see I can see that dimpling probably because I put too much silicone in And then I actually have the whole clock base 
that I will uh, the whole clock base that I'll put it all back together and hopefully this will be a success yeah. so we'll see um, how that looks it's all draining down the middle into the lazy Susan which works too and awesome just a smidge of silver which is great cool thanks for watching i'll post another uh quick update um make sure to like later oh yeah like and subscribe right <laughs> yeah like and, like and subscribe the awesome. internet awesome okay thanks Bye. all right there it is finished up if you can see it without the glare Put it back together, put the numbers back on, cleaned up the glass. It's hard to see the details without all the stuff in the back. There they are, a bunch of silver cells. That's why I had to break up with the silver again because it was way too silvery. But it looks great with the accents. Awesome. All right, one more just to look at the details. You see the purple, the brown, the blue. A little bit of the yellow, not much. See my reflection. Hi. Awesome, thanks for watching.